fans, Bly here. We're doing a little quick episode with Emporium Galactic Survival. Um, and what we're going to be doing here is traveling to a distant planet. Now, I've always find it a little difficult um, how to go ahead and get the most direct path. And I may not have the answer, but currently I'm trying to get to this... Uh, K Alpha sector. So I've been traveling, and in this server you can travel a hundred light years uh, distance. So normally it's like, I think it was like 30, 30 something. But at any rate, it's a far distance away. So yeah, I'm trying to find the best way, and I'm going to show you what I found to be the best way. Now, if anybody has any comments or other ways to do that, please. Uh, put down some comments and uh, if there's a video that is on YouTube there link that video uh, but I just wanted to kind of share this because it's still a little tricky and I have to do with several steps to do it so I uh, just wanted to show you how a lot of times guys have some pretty simple questions like this and they don't get answered so Anyhow, I'm going right here to this little whirly whirly galaxy map symbol. We're going to search. We're going to type in that. K alpha. K L is enough. We're going to click on that. I'm going to click on show on map. So that star now is lit. And it won't let you lock it here. So I go back into galaxy map. I have it selected and then I lock target. So it lets you lock it here. Now you got to back out, and you can kind of see it there. That's kind of direction, 298 light years away, so I definitely, you know, can't make it there. Um, so I got to go back into my map. We're gonna go into the galaxy map thing again, and see what. It, so this little orange guy is over here. Now it's really hard for me to see, and uh, I'm a colorblind guy, so it makes everything even harder. But they have, um, right now we're in a, uh, in between territories, uh, but you can get all these territory things lit up when you click on that. It shows you different territories that you're in, uh, and there's uh, uh, regional names that will pop up. You see in the upper left, you see it says Drone Lands right there. Yeah, so that's uh, this particular uh, region. And then warp lines is where you came from and where you're going to, well, what not where you're going to. Um, so we're trying to get to that um, yellow marker. So I just, I, I'm kind of lining it up and I'm going to kind of put it like underneath uh, this registry tab. And then I'm going to just come straight down until you can't go anymore. And then what I'm doing is I'm using my right mouse button, and I'm just going to attempt to just drag straight down as best as possible. I'm going to do this several times because we can go 100 light years. So I can mouse over that. See, that's 25 light years away. So you might not be able to jump this far on a regular server. We're going to see what we get and going several times and trying again to make it as straight as possible. And I am using the mouse, so there may be. I can try to arrow up and everything, but let me get this sorted first. See, that's 72 light years. What's this one? See, that's a little further down. So 108. That's 102. So let's go ahead and I think we're going to warp to that one. I don't see that going too far right or left is helpful. I think it's just waste and pentax. So let's pick this one. We're going to, I just going to click on that uh, left mouse button, lock target. Okay, and now that's 100 light years away. I'm going to back out. Let me see if the arrow keys. No, the arrow keys is not moving the map at all. Uh, shift an arrow, no. Control an arrow, no. 
so I'm not sure what would make it move with the uh, keyboard strokes that might make it go straighter in one direction uh, the whole thing is we don't have the depth yeah, I mean I can be going further south or further north but I'm just kinda in generally moving forward toward my destination um, so if I try and look back obviously it's gone because now this star is selected so we're gonna exit out and it's kinda you know uh, is in the direction the ship was pointing so we're kinda going in the right way and I may have enough Pentax to make this jump I don't I only have 74 so far made so we're gonna go ahead and um, go into our P menu uh, we got 700 made up so I've been making as I run there's supposed to be some action going on over here um, so that's why I'm picking that so in my P menu um, I'm gonna go ahead and open up this is the way I like to do some of these things you can do it other ways but I, I'm gonna select Pentax on this window and I'm gonna go ahead and drop down to my classic here and then I'm gonna go ahead and pick the main cargo that's where it's being dropped into and I'm just gonna slide it right over there so now we got 800 we should have we got 400 we're gonna need to make these jumps I guess so you gotta be traveling um, and I think I don't know how fast but I think it's got to be at least 30 uh, meters per second so we're going we're gonna press K to warp and off we go so the thing is now that it's been reset your marker and I don't know like I said that there's any other way to keep the other marker there but you always gotta it appears I have to now go into my menu again go into the galaxy map now I'm gonna have to search system again okay alpha we are gonna select that same one show it on the map back out one because it's not gonna let me select it now I can select it lock target escape So there it is. Okay, map. Galaxy again. And we're going to try to... It's right there. So we're going to put that right under that. See where that registry tab is. There's, there's got to be another way, but... This might be it. I mean, I don't know. If I keep it pretty straight, then at least I will be aiming in the right direction. And on we go. Maybe that. How far is this? 130, holy smokes, we've been far already. 105, 99.5, let's pick that one. Let's lock that target. And let's escape out. And yeah, 99.5. So, and we're going to repeat that process until um, we get to that planet. So, I just wanted to share that uh, with everybody. In some of these games, a lot of stuff is not uh, easily explained and you can be bouncing around all over the place but this is kind of helping me at least get not a hundred percent but in the right direction as far as right or left now up and down is a little bit questionable but um, yeah I think that's uh, gonna be helpful for a lot of people on how to travel far in this game um, and what I'm, I'm trying to get to where a few people on the server are fighting some some AI so I'm gonna try and gang up on on these AIs with them and um, try and have a little fun so thanks for watching the video I hope uh, you guys felt this useful hope you guys will like the video and uh, can continue to make some more and any advice you guys have if you like the 
like the uh, concept of watching these videos I need to learn as much as possible I'm new to this so any critiques are are always welcome so thank you very much and we'll catch you on the next one